This is Dylan from British English Coach, and this is another business English idiom. And this idiom is to pay dividends. Okay, so first of all, you may not know the term dividend. It's a financial term. And basically, a dividend is a payment of profits that's divided among the shareholders of a company. So if you're a shareholder and you're one of 10 shareholders and your company makes a hundred pounds or a hundred dollars or a hundred euros profit, then you each get a share of that, which if it's an equal share, it will be 10 euros, dollars, pounds each. So that will be your dividend. So here's a sentence. If I were you, I'd take out a loan and finish your MBA master in business administration. In the long run, it will pay dividends. So what could this mean to pay dividends? Could it be A, to do something that will bring benefits in the future? Option B, to pay for something over a long period of time? Or option C, to do something because it's a requirement in your profession or your field? Let's look at the sentence again. If I were you, I'd take out a loan and finish your MBA. In the long run, it will pay dividends. Which definition is the best, A, B, or C? And the answer is, it's option A. If you do something that pays dividends, you do something that will bring benefits in the future. You do something now because you know it will be very beneficial it'll be a big advantage in the future. So something that's basically a good investment pays dividends. Couple of questions for you. What about improving your English? Do you think improving your English will pay dividends in the future? Is that your main motivation for studying English? Maybe at the moment you're spending a lot of money, you're spending a lot of time, you're putting in a lot of effort improving your English. And maybe the results aren't obvious now, but in 10 years time, when you get your opportunity to work in one of the top companies in the United States or the city of London, maybe all that work will pay dividends. And if you're working at the moment, what actions could your company take that would pay dividends at some point in the future? Okay, so that's something to think about. Maybe tell your boss if you have any great ideas. So what do you think about this sentence? Is it correct? Training our employees in the new program will incur a substantial cost, but it will pay dividends as will be a step ahead of our competitors when the new law comes into effect in 2019. So if something incurs a substantial cost, it basically means it will cost a lot of money. Is that correct or incorrect? It's correct. It's fine. Training our employers in the new program, perhaps a new computer program, will incur a substantial cost. It will cost a lot of money at the moment, but it will pay dividends. It will be beneficial in the future, as will be a step ahead of our competitors when the new law comes into effect in 2019. Maybe the new law will mean that things have to change in 2019 and you'll have to use that particular program. So investing now won't have any immediate results, but in two, three, four years time, it will pay dividends. It will bring benefits. Okay. So that was to pay dividends. I hope your English learning pays dividends at some point. This was Dylan from British English coach and see you next time for another business English idiom. Bye for now.